Well, greetings from Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota. You can visit all of our website and see all of our cars at www.ellingsonmotorcars.com. Today we're going to show you a really neat old car. You'll recognize it from a movie. Well, greetings from Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota. On our showroom floor, we have our newest acquisition, a 1948 Packard Victoria Convertible. Packard decided to get back into doing some convertibles again after the war, and boy, do they come up with a stellar design here. It was deemed one of the most beautiful cars of 1948. Uh, if you look at this car, you can see everything on this car has been done and to a very high level of restoration. Absolutely incredible paint. I mean, we were just making the comment, it has to be one of the prettiest colors we've seen on one of these early Packards in many, many years. And the chrome work, look at how beautiful the chrome work is on the, the uh, hood ornament or whatever. It's certainly something that you can see when you're driving and people come down the road, they know what they're looking at. Again, Packard in 1948-49, pretty much the same body. They would do a few different things with the grill, a little bit of different uh, trim work and some of, the, some of that stuff just to differentiate them. But Packard didn't really follow the norm when it came to uh, what cars and what years. They kind of interchanged, went for quite a number of years before they really started to uh, give them their own years uh, definition. Uh, this one came with uh, fog lamps, which was another nice option back in the day because the lighting, of course, from some of those original headlights is probably a little on the dim side, if you know what I mean. Uh, when I alluded in the beginning, in uh, one of the most famous movies of all times in my book, is Back to the Future, old Doc Brown had a Packard. His was a 49 Packard convertible. This is a 48, but very, very similar cars. So really, really a neat old car. And again, something that you've seen in the movies, most people don't even know what the car was but it is actually a Packard, a 22nd series, as a matter of fact. Uh, beautiful white wall tires, uh, the radials, so you get that nice ride that you probably didn't get back in 1948 from the old bias tires. And it's got the beauty rings with the Packard emblazoned hubcaps right in the middle. Again, in those days, people really wanted to let you know what kind of car you were driving, and Packard still had kind of that elegant, high-end luxury end in mind. Uh, another interesting note, it does have a Packard spotlight on it. Many people wondered why did they have spotlights back in the 40s and 50s? Uh, mainly one of the reasons was they didn't have good street lights. So if you were trying to find an address on a home or whatever, the spotlight was about the only way you can do it while you were still sitting in your car. Just an interesting note. Uh, if you look at the interior on this car, lots of really beautiful uh, a leather interior, highly done to a very, very high level of restoration. The steering wheel is just really, really beautiful, and the chrome and the horn ring is just impeccable. It's like one of the nicest ones, again, that I've seen in many, many years. Uh, Packard also had uh, uh, power windows and a power top. I mean, people didn't realize, but even in 1948, they still had a power top, hit a button, and the top would come up. This car, I believe, also has the hydraulic windows. Uh, probably not one of the best innovations of the day, but uh, still, people were using them, and it was a luxury option that you had. Uh, it's got the skirts on the back. Like you say, the chrome, the chrome on this car is just impeccable. And it's just, it's a super model, so it just has the one piece of Beltline chrome down the bottom of the car. And uh, other than that, uh, you know, it's just one of those really, really well restored cars. We always have to remember it's got the hood that opens sideways, both ways, and you only can do one side at a time. Do not do both levers at once or your hood's gonna fall off the car, which <clears throat> would not make anybody happy. You can come and visit us in person at Ellingson Motor Cars right here in Rogers. We're open Monday through Saturday from 10 until 5. Love to have you come in person. Take a look. I mean, we have almost 100 vehicles on our sales floor at all times from everything such as this absolutely beautiful restored stock vehicle to muscle cars, street rods, uh, resto mod pickups and the like. We've got a wide, wide variety. Uh, you can also find us on Facebook and YouTube and Instagram. Make us a favorite. There's always little videos and little tidbits of information for everybody that enjoys old cars. So if you're looking for something that, uh, you know, in 1948 you would have been an extremely special person to have a car of this sort, guess what? 
in the year 2020, you are also a very special person if you have a car like this. Come and visit at Allingson's. We always have something to show you.